Hi, I'm Dr. G. I talk a lot about resilience and recently a patient of mine asked me an excellent question. He said, what's the point? And I said, what do you mean? And he said, what's the point of being resilient just to get on to the next hard thing? It's a great question. The point of being resilient is not to continue to navigate things you don't want to navigate. The point of being resilient is to navigate change and come through it with intention and purpose. It's to come through it the kind of person you want to be. It is to get the life you most want. That doesn't mean we get to just resilient our way to having unlimited financial resources and every relationship come easily to us. That's not how life works. But the point of resilience is to figure out how to navigate change and get closest to the life that we want. Last week on my weekly email that I send out, and if you're seeing this but you don't subscribe, you should. Look here, right there in the comments. I'll tell you how. I asked a question. I said, make a list of your five top priorities. I don't mean your priorities this week or things that are bothering you the most. I mean the five things that are most important to you. And then I made a list of my own and I sent it out as an example. And I believe it or not, put my own health and well-being on my own list. I didn't say these have to be in order because the order changes depending on the day and what's going on with the people in your life and your work and all those things. But pick your top five priorities, the ones that are pretty stable for you. And so if you haven't done that, do that for me right now, okay? And if you did, because hundreds of you sent back to me your list last week, Go grab that, pull up that email where you answered me and look at your list. There are two different ways to use the resilience that you have, the life that you have, to really get the life that you want. You can use this list either by zooming way in or way out. Let's first talk about zooming way in. Zoom way in and look at each thing on that list and make sure that you're doing something this week that allows you to get closer to or really enjoy that priority. Or zoom way out and look at that list and ask yourself if you are living pretty aligned to that list. It doesn't mean everything's going well in all those areas. It doesn't mean you have all the answers in those areas. But are those areas where you're putting your time, your resources, your attention? And if they are, then you are already using your resilience to get the life you want. And if you look at that list and you think you're not, then there is absolutely no reason to not make the changes to make sure you do. No matter what obstacles you're facing with health, with finances, with obstacles you cannot control, you can still put your time and your attention on the things that matter most to you.